So really quickly, I just wanted to touch on how I color grade uh, my red Komodo footage because I got a lot of questions when I've been posting some recent stills. And it's very, very simple. Very, very simple. There's like three main things. The first of which is when I bring my footage into Premiere, I always apply three things. I apply two Lumetri color uh, effects and a levels effect. From there, with that first Lumetri color effect, I have a Rec 709 like standard, um, you know, basically conversion LUT from Red themselves. So I'll try and put that in a Dropbox link and link that in the description below. It's just a simple conversion LUT from Red that takes that like log footage and converts it to like a Rec 709, um, you know, kind of standard look. So I'll do that and apply that, and then. I can change basically the intensity of that and sometimes I leave it at 100 and sometimes I drop it down to 75%. Anywhere between 75 to 100% I'll kind of have that conversion applied in the first Lumetri tab. Then the next Lumetri tab is where I kind of choose my grading. From there I'll pick a LUT and usually um, you know I use Tropicolor LUTs because those are our LUTs and uh, I love the looks and depending on the style of project, that's what I'll you know, use. If it's kind of a vintage look, I'll use one of the vintage LUTs. If, if it's something more urban and gritty, I might use archival or you know, the urban LUTs. So uh, from there, I'll apply a LUT and then I'll just, depending on the footage, take the intensity anywhere from 25 to 75%. And so you always wanna add the LUT in the creative drop down tab that's where you can change the intensity because a lot of people think they just apply a LUT and it's like way overdone and it's too much and it's so intense, but you can dial down the intensity in that creative tab. So you still get the same color kind of look and profile and grade, but it just lessens the intensity so it's not overdone, if that makes sense. So those are the first two things I'll do. Then the third thing is with that levels tab, I play with the different levels, kind of give it either a fade or I'll crush the blacks more. Um, you know, or give it kind of a blue tint. And I play with those levels and there's so many different kind of keyframes and stuff in there that you can do or, or tabs you can mess with, but I'll mess with that. So those are the like the three main effects that I use to grade the footage. And then from there, it's obviously, it's everything's to taste. Do I drop the contrast? Do I boost the highlights? Is this image a darker, moodier one? I'm, okay, I'm gonna crush and drop the shadows and the blacks. So everything with color um, and color grading is very much to your own taste and to the taste of the project and what the project is calling for. I just wanted to speak on what are the three things that I do to grade my footage. It's to add those two Lumetri effects and a levels effect. And then from there, I play with all of those colors. So you have the standard rec conversion LUT, the graded LUT, um, the style, and then the levels. And then from there, I play with all of those different things until I get the color the way I want it to look but I always grade off of the most, you know, raw, flat, red, raw uh, color profile. And that is how I color graded my red Komodo footage, as well as pretty much any footage, uh, whether it's from my Komodo or from my red helium. So hopefully that helped. I know this is less of like a button pushing tutorial and, and more of like just kind of explaining briefly how, how I color grade. Um, so hopefully this helps. If you guys want to see a more in depth one where it's all button pushing and exactly what I do, uh, let me know. Comment below. And see you guys on the next one. Peace.